Governor Andy Bashir paid a visit to Jenny Wiley State Resort Park on Friday, February 2nd to recognize the Kentucky State Park Centennial. Park workers, rangers, and other officials were in attendance to celebrate the history of Jenny Wiley and make progress towards improving the park's aspects and attractions. Governor Bashir voices his appreciation and compassion for the park. Our system of state parks is second to none, the best in the country a place where our families have, have made such incredible memories that serve as community centers to bring us together and that bring travelers from all over the nation and all over the world. Our park system is one of our most treasured legacies and as we know, especially at Jenny Wyland, it's a resource that allows us to be there for our people in their toughest of times. In the past three years, our parks have opened to help survivors of tornadoes, of floods, and even right now, in several of our counties suffering from water shortages and difficulties, our state parks have stepped up once again, offering water, showers, and whatever's needed. Let's thank them one more time for being here. Do you worry about having enough money to last throughout retirement? Give Reed Potter at Raymond James a call. Reed has 26 years experience helping folks enjoy their best life in their retirement years. Improvements to the park include the marina replacement project, higher quality maintenance for the golf course, and general hospitality upgrades. Bashir's proposal has been nearly completely fulfilled and changes are on their way soon. My proposal includes a marina reconstruction, which I think is the largest or one of the largest projects proposed for our state parks. It includes the new archery center and accommodation hospitality upgrades. Uh, the house uh, has come close, but not close enough to what we've asked for overall. Of new projects, they have $112 million of the 182 we've requested. It's up to us in the rest of this session to make sure our local legislators and the House and the Senate know how important our state parks are. And let me tell you, the process is working. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.